You get one chance and one chance only. Winning's not an alternative to me. I want to be somebody with a feeling that borders on almost being fanatical. Folks, I want to make a dadgum difference with my life. And I've been in this business 19 years now, and I find myself at a moment that everything I truly dreamed about is within our grasp, you know? And uh, A.O. Williams, I've told you this before, but when, when I envisioned in 1976 with, with those 85 people, we began to visualize you know, founding our own company and knowing the obstacles that we had to go over just to survive. You know, the biggest problem you have when you go in business is just surviving. I believe uh, the main reason most people fail is they just don't give them time, themselves enough time in business. Ninety plus percent of all people that go in business in America fail, you know, the first year. And everybody's just always quitting right before they give it enough time uh, to work for them. And so oh, the biggest challenge we had in our initial uh, years at A.O. Williams was just surviving. We were always having to change companies because we wrote companies out of money or wrote them out of administration. Uh, we just didn't have the things we needed to really compete and win with. And we were just a struggle just to survive. And then now, folks, all of a sudden, we find ourselves in a moment of history where we can do something magnificent. And my biggest worry, folks, is people not going for it, number one, you know? Folks, A.O. Williams was built for people like you. You are special. You are different. A.O. Williams is a dream come true for people like me. We got people like you that are worse off than you. They got less going for it than you that today are financially independent. 19 years ago when I went in this business, I think one reason I was successful in sales is because I tried to look is what was so repulsive to the American people about insurance salespeople. People financially sell life insurance in America. They truly do cross the street to avoid talking to you. And, and, I, and I was a football coach. I didn't want people to think of me as a dadgum insurance salesperson. And so I, I started thinking, you know, what really turns people off? High pressure, fast talking, you know, salespeople that go in and go for the dadgum throat and all that kind of stuff. And I wanted to be a different kind of salesperson. I wanted to go in and make people feel comfortable, get your hands off your pocketbook. I want to compete for your business. I want to really do a good job for you. If I can, I don't sell policies. I don't want your dadgum business. And I think from that kind of environment, folks, it gave A.O. Williams a chance today to be positioned to do something absolutely mind-boggling. I remember my six year in the business, I paid $35,000 a year. Six year in the business. I know very few full-timers that come to work at A.O. Williams that do as little as I did for as long as I did, right? But see, what you do is you look at the results of my 21 years of work, and you say 200,000, 6,000 RVPs, a mansion, an airplane, a yard. I can't see an old coach doing that. I think that's what kills most people in this finish. You don't think it can happen to you. I've been told all my life that people that look like you, that come from where you come from with your education, that ain't no way you can build something gigantic. Some of you jokers out there in the field that are making a million a year and 300,000 a year and 100,000 a year, I want you to know I've been told all my business life that people that look like us, that come from where we come from, ain't capable of building something magnificent, building something with class. I worry that the success in A.O. Williams, the awesome success, I mean, I'm already getting this from some of you right now. We get up here and we show this awesome success. This intimidates you and you say, I can't be that good. I can't be that good. I can't compete. Don't, folks, don't let, don't, don't say yourself short. It was built for people. None of us ever thought we could be this good. I never saw Art Williams being a salesperson, a leader, making big money, having great responses. Try, go out there and try.